you think you're going to be sensible? Just buy the odd VHS. Because you've had hundreds of these in the past. And you've literally thrown them down the tip. So what a great idea in 2022 to start buying VHS again. How sensible is that? Now has this habit got out of control? I ask myself. And do I need to expect a knock on the door from a lovely chap in a white coat holding a straight jacket? Because why on earth would you spend money on all this crap you've thrown out once before? So this is the extent of the VHS collection at present. And this, might, I might add, is not including the music videos I've picked up. This is just purely film and TV based stuff. Now I would add, it's so cheap to buy. That, that's the bloody real sort of... It makes this too easy, really, getting into this hole. Let me know what you think. It's madness. I wish I hadn't started, really. I'm definitely... I can see myself throwing some of these away. So we've gone through sort of various individual films there. Then we're into sort of collections here. We've got some Bruce Lee look. Then we've got the Indiana Jones collection. I've also got Back to the Future, actually. That's not here. That's on display. That's why I've missed them. So then we've picked up... I did. I bought... I got these some time ago. I did a little short. I got all these for free. So happy days, really. The complete James Bond selection. Collection, rather. Up to Dawn of the Day, anyway. I don't think you can get VHS for the Daniel Craig films. But let me know. And then... We've recently branched out into TV DVD uh, videos, and we've we've amassed only fools and horses. One foot in the grave, greatest TV show ever made, Dad's Army, and I open all those. So, for God's sake, run for your lives! If you're thinking of getting into VHS collecting, honestly, think twice about it because. It's so easy and so cheap, it can very, very quickly get way out of hand. Rocky IV, that's one of the, that's one of the original ones I thought, I'm just going to pick a few up. I want, I want Rocky IV, because I used to love that, and you know, fond memories of going to see that at cinema. There's still some other stuff I haven't bought yet, which was on my initial sort of a dozen list of ones I'd like to buy, like Ghostbusters and Robocop. Some of this crap I wouldn't have bought if I paid like money, it's just come in bundles to be fair. It's in Jurassic Park, well the first two anyway. So there we go, I just, has anybody else got this problem? I'm looking at you, Geordie Slasher. How many have you got now? Honestly. Save yourself. Save yourself. Run.